Today I will let you know about the difference between the three commonly performed refractive procedures PRK, LASIK and SMILE. PRK is photo refractive keratectomy. It is a touch free blade free procedure wherein an eczema laser is directly passed onto the surface of the cornea to correct the refractive error which a subject has. In LASIK we use a micro keratome, a sharp blade which is used to create a flap and after creating a flap the base is treated with the same laser which is used in PRK. Whereas SMILE is a lenticule based procedure which uses a femtosecond laser and that laser cuts the extra tissue which is needed to be removed and that extra tissue we call it as lenticule we remove it through a small incision made on the cornea. So these are the three differences between PRK, LASIK and SMILE. PRK has advantage that it can be done for thinner corneas and it can also be done for the people who want to continue playing this contact sports or who have demanding jobs. LASIK has a sharp recovery time and it has the advantage of better healing compared to PRK. SMILE is totally a blade free procedure and uses in state of art femtosecond technology and a very small incision is used so the recovery is very smooth with smile in fact on day one 90 percent of the patient would be able to see almost near total vision prk is best suited for those who have thinner corneas and who want to continue using playing the contact sports lasik is for most of the patients it is suitable and it has a very early recovery time compared to PRK. Smile has an advantage over the LASIK for the patients who have some amount of dryness in their eyes and it has an, a very early recovery and is among all the three procedures the latest in the market. Coming to recovery time for these three procedures, PRK has a little uh, longer recovery time of four to seven days but during that recovery period for patient's comfort we use a bandage contact lens. LASIK has a intermediary recovery time of two to three days and SMILE has the shortest recovery time of day one and it is even better for those who have dryness in their eyes. Whenever we do any surgical procedure we look at safety and efficacy of the procedure. So with respect to safety all the three procedures are pretty safe when they are performed on the right eyes and recovery time is as I explained earlier ranges between two days to one week but at the end of that recovery time all the three procedures provide you almost similar and excellent results with respect to the correction of the refractive errors. If you want to break free from the spectacles and you are still in some confusion which procedure suits you the best you can book an appointment with us and come to us because not all the procedures are meant for every eye and we will help you understand in person which procedure suits you the best. Hello, I'm Dr. Hussain. I'm a refractive surgeon and phaco and glaucoma surgeon at Dr. Agarwal's Eye Hospital, Secunderabad.